Hello everybody. Welcome to Greg's Beer Reviews today. Time to take that walk and go see what's in the fridge today. Hey everybody, welcome to Greg's Beer Review today. Thanks so much for stopping by. I do appreciate it. Today's beer is Prairie Artisan Ales Pirate Weekend, guys. Uh, I've heard this. I've heard some conflicting stories. I've heard people has had infected bottles of this recently, and uh, people have absolutely loved it. So we're going to find out whether I have a very very tasty bottle or something infected. This probably. I'm not going to be drinkable if it is. Anyway, we shall see. Uh, I bought this. It will on the shelf. It, the price was ten ninety nine. So, uh, and it is a fourteen point four percenter here, guys. So, uh, Imperial Stout. So, and these guys are out of Oklahoma. Uh, so, and the only place I can get these is at the craft beer store. Kroger's don't carry stuff like this. Anyway. Uh, over to Untapped. Untapped says Rum Barrel Aged Stout. I prefer bourbon myself, but uh, with coconut, cocoa nibs, and marshmallow. Hmm, interesting combination there. So, uh, and on the back here it says Pirate Web something. 11 10 21 so this is a november 10th of 2021 edition i guess it doesn't say bottled on or anything it doesn't say best buy or anything it's just got that date on it so i'm assuming that's when they put it in this bottle so i shall see into the glass for good little small 12 ounce bottle that's what they do their stuff in I don't I don't think I've seen anything in 16 ounce I may be wrong but you know well if it's something in a 16 ounce can you can charge the same price for a 12 ounce <laughs> that's how they think that's how it works guys that's how it works well Lord if we put it in a 16 ounce can it'd be $20 yeah probably so not much head on that guys pitch black how much head? Big beer. Uh, Untapped says 13%, so I don't know. It's a 2021 edition. I don't know if there's a... Uh, let me see real quick. Uh, P -I -O -E. I don't think it's going to give me a, any variation. 20. Yes. 2021 okay 13% is what they're saying the 2021 edition is and that's what this one says that that is a bottled on date so that's what we're going to go with 13% uh, same description so same beer guys it's been flapping so there is no it didn't pour much head I mean hardly any zero may have got 0.05% but there's none now so hmm to the nose we go. Oh, that, that smells nice. It doesn't smell infected. Usually you, to me, the stouts usually end up with a, a heavy butterscotch taste and aroma. I'm getting coconut, caramel, maybe hints of rum, marshmallow, I mean, May even be a little chocolate in there. It smells awesome, guys. It really does. So let's get in it. Cheers. Wow, that is that is pretty good. That is real good. That's worthy. That is worthy, guys. That's a that's an eleven dollar bottle of beer, basically. So, but thirteen percent. Aged in rum barrels, uh, very nice, 
This one's not infected, guys. That is super tasty. That is absolutely super tasty. I'm impressed with this. I'm very impressed with this. So, uh, guys, we're going to go out on the deck, get the stogie, kick back, let it come up to room temperature, and sip on it, and I'll be right back. All right, guys, I'm back. No lacing. Zero lacing. 13%. A lot of times you don't get lacing with 13% of guys, and that's what we have here. Super tasty beer, guys. Excellent final beer of the evening, which it is for me. Uh, yes, it's, it's worthy. It is worthy, guys. I mean, super smooth, easy to drink. I mean, I wish it had been a 16-ounce instead of a 12. Uh, I'm... I don't think I'm about done with 12 ounce beers, guys. What do you think about that? I mean, I'll pay another dollar or two if you give me 16 of it instead of 12. So, I mean, I've got to that point where 12 ounce beers don't appeal to me anymore, especially since I can only have a couple of days. So, uh, give me 16. I'll pay a little bit more, but that's just me. That's just me. Super tasty. About a cup. The rum on this works. I mean, it's, it's, yes, it works. Everything else to go with it, nice and creamy, nice mouthfeel. Super tasty, guys. Yes, it's a winner, guys, for me. Uh, as far as I'm concerned, I'll, I'm, I'm going to kick it up. I thought I was going to give it a, a solid A, but I'm going to kick it up to 98. 98 for me on this one, guys. I went from a 95 to a 98 because it's so smooth and easy drinking for a 13 percenter. The rum works. I'm getting all the notes from the rum. Coconut's not overpowering. It's fair, but it's kind of subtle to me. Uh, cocoa nibs and chocolate, yeah. I'm getting that. It's not overpowering. It's subtle. Uh, marshmallow, the vanilla. Yes. Yes. It's there. It's fair. So, guys, Pirate Weekend, the 2021 edition, which I have here, super tasty, worthy. So, if you've had it, let me know what you think, guys. And as you've seen on the video there, i got to make a trip across town and get some more beers. Until I do, tell me to get. Let's go see what's in the fridge.